Greta Thunberg has been arrested in London for participating in a protest. The protest was about oil and gas company executives meeting up with government officials. A meeting that is super dangerous and would cause catastrophic level disasters. Therefore, it is absolutely imperative and very important to stop that from happening at all cost. Why? To prevent this. Also, when they arrested Greta in London, they drove her away in a diesel car. I see what you did there, UK government. Hashtag statement. Hashtag sending a message. But wait, isn't UK like the world leaders of renewable energy? Doesn't UK have like the most number of renewable energy research institutions in the world? Like, didn't UK invest tons of money into renewable energy? Well, if you Google it, UK is a leader in renewable energy. It started off long, long time ago, when the United Kingdom in the 90s were being powered by mainly coal and nuclear. They have since undergone massive energy transition to now being powered by clean and modern fuel. Gas. Gas currently has the largest market share of energy generation in the UK. One of the highest that it has ever been actually. But the UK has made huge commitments to the green energy agenda. They signed the Paris Accord and pledged to increase their renewable energy share to a whopping 15%. Also, a bunch of people who are enjoying this channel is not subscribed yet. If you haven't, please subscribe, it helps a lot. The UK is home to a large number of renewable energy research centers. The only other country that comes close is Germany. With so much research going on, innovation and improvements of renewable energy is bound to happen in the UK. It's just that the UK is also home to the largest amount of oil and gas companies in the world. There's like thousands of oil and gas companies who have their HQ in the UK. In London, there are oil and gas companies based there. Then, these are the renewable energy institutions in London. They are f***ing outnumbered. To be fair, there's like 3 renewable energy institutions based in London. That is 3 more than most cities. How many renewable energy institutions does your city have, huh? But in terms of oil and gas companies, first we look at Qatar, then we look at Saudi, and last of all, we look at London. I think there's a clear winner here. Why is there so many oil and gas companies based in the UK? Does the UK have an exceptional amount of oil and gas? What do you have there in the UK that you're not supposed to have? Next, the British have invested lots of money into renewable energy. This is a source straight from the gov.uk website. But they have also invested tons of money into something else. And it's a lot more money. This is a source straight from the gov.uk website. Also, the UK have been cutting investments into renewable energy recently. Why are you holding back? Especially when you already have so many institutions working on it. Are you afraid of the institutions? Also, this holding back part reminds me of this great empire that went out and conquered the world in the name of spice. But they hold back tremendously when applying the spice to their food. Quite some similarities there. The UK have claimed that they have reached 100% renewables at times. Upon a closer look, it's more of a fake 100% renewable, like 5 a.m. on a New Year's Day Germany type of 100% renewable, and not like the more legitimate 100% renewable energy supply in Spain. I did a Spain video and a Germany video, links in the description below. So a little bit of recap. Coal is getting cancelled but wants the show proof to have existed. Gas is the new main fuel and is here to stay. Hydro is too small, check the scale. Solar has some good growth but is now stagnant. Wind is not showing any signs of slowing down yet. Legalized burning is all the way up. Also, the UK is not an exporting system since last year. Previously, they took cheap energy from France. Oil have seen significant drop over the years, but in the recent times, it is making a comeback. 
It could be due to a certain conference that's happening. Nuclear has peaked, but remains stable and relevant. You're watching the Funzi channel. Do, 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 do.